Okay, so it says when doing blood testing for a viral infection, the procedure can be made more efficient and less expensive by combining partial samples of different blood specimens. If samples from five people are combined, the mixture test tests negative, we know all five samples are negative. Find the probability of a positive result for five samples combined into one mixture. Assuming the probability of an individual blood sample being positive for the virus is 0 0.02. So we're looking for the, pro the probability that at least one is positive. Okay, so you have to figure out the chances of one are positive. Two are positive, three are positive, up to five, if that's a painstaking process. So what I'm going to do instead is figure out the complement. I'm going to say, okay, what's the probability that none are positive? I'll just subtract that from one. I'll get the same answer. So the first thing I want to do is figure out, okay, what's the probability that, that the first person in the group is not positive? Well, if the, if the probability for, for positive test result is 0 0.02, the probability for a not positive test result is 0.98. For the first one, times 0.98 for the second, times 0.98 for the third, times so on and so forth, 0.98 to the fifth for all five people, all five samples. So to get the complement, I'm just going to do 1 minus 0.98 to the fifth power. All right, so here we go. Do 1 minus 0.98 to the fifth power. I get 0 0.0961. Or 9.6%. That's it.